Death Valley Cape Style, next! CapeCast! Howdy folks, I'm Eric Williams and welcome to CapeCast, the official webcast of the Cape Cod Times for August 27th. We head into a Provincetown desert in the second half of the show, but first let's take a look at news. Mashpee soldier Paul Conlon was laid to rest yesterday at the Massachusetts National Cemetery with full military honors. Conlon was killed in Afghanistan on August 15th by a roadside bomb. Senator John Kerry and Governor Deval Patrick were among those who attended a memorial service earlier in the day. In the nectar nibbler department, a rare broad-billed hummingbird has been sighted in Dennis at the home of Ron and Marge Murphy. According to our own bird expert E. Vernon Locks, the sighting has, quote, jazzed, unquote, the local birding community. Hey, folks, Cape Cass pulled a Lawrence of Arabia yesterday and conquered the giant province lands desert. We're here in Provincetown at Snail Road, and we're heading into the Cape's Kalahari. The province lands, wide desert scapes, mysterious structures, and a long walk to the beach. Is it a beach too far? We'll find out. So, Brian... How long is it to get to the ocean here? What am I getting into? Uh, it may only be a mile, but it's in deep sand. Half of it is uphill, steep hills, and it's quite a hike. What about yeah. water and stuff? Should I have that? You'd better have water, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's not a pleasant walk. It's not a stroll. You don't stroll from here to the beach. It's a trek. You're going to trek from here to the beach. I guess I should probably just give up now, right? No, take a, take a shot at it. If you do it, you can say you did something. It's an accomplishment. All right. Hey, thanks a lot. You're welcome. Apparently, we've got a lot of walking to do, a lot more than we thought. A giant rise behind us potentially will yield an ocean view but still more hills of heartache. I'm getting that foreign legion feeling, you know, when you're abandoned in North Africa, you're out of water, and cannibalism ensues. Hopefully that won't happen here. Well, we've made it to a place where we can see the mighty Atlantic right behind me there. Feeling confident now that we can be like Aborigines in the outback, confident, striding along, looking for giant rocks. One step at a time, I tell you, one step at a time. Here we see a dune shack in the province lands. One of those sort of get away from it all, no power kind of artsy, get in touch with yourself places. I spent a night in one of these once. Uh, was disappointed to find out that the local pizza place wouldn't deliver. Well, we got to do some walking here and get out there. While we go, let's hear a little Harry Kemp poetry. He was the poet of these dunes, living out here in the dune shacks, all wild, all crazy, no longer with us. But it's time to remember his poetry. I'd like to return to the world again, to the dutiful workaday world of men. For I'm sick of the beachcomber's lot, of the one volcano flaming hot with the snow round its edge and the fire in its throat and the tropical island that seems afloat. We're here interviewing the province land's giraffe, Jerry. And Jerry, how do you feel today? Cracking, Eric, cracking, full of vinegar. What's it like living in a giant northeastern desert? Sometimes it's lonely, but I have many friends among the creatures. And what about the people, Jerry? I love those bipeds. I just hope they wear enough sunscreen. That's terrific. Have a great day. You too, Eric. Cheerio! And finally, the ocean. Oh, this is a good probably 20 minutes if you went straight out, up and down. Not for the faint of heart or Cape Cast types, but we made it anyway. A few brave beachgoers out there, they have earned this beautiful piece of heaven by making the crazy walk across the province lands. Now let's check the all-important Cape and Islands weather forecast, backed by goat video from Barnstable Village. For tonight, clear with a low around 56, and for Thursday, sunny with a high near 75. Okay, we've got to get out of here. This has been Cape Cast for August 27th. Till next time, see ya! Cape Cast!
Capecast.